Hello everyone, welcome to Falcon Informatics. In this video, I am going to show how to do the contact management system Python project using Python. So for that, I am using only two libraries. The first one is tkinter and the second one is SQLite. The reason why I am using tkinter libraries in order to create an interactive GUI, we will use a tkinter library. It is one of the famous library for creating a GUI. And the second one is the SQLite. Uh, the reason why I am using this library is it is very useful to store the data in database compared to other storage medium. That's why we are using SQLite here. So we will store the data in database. So data are nothing but like the basic details like contact name, age, gender. Likewise, we are storing basic details in database. And this GUI is developed by one developer called Mark Arvin. So he is the one who developed this project. And I'm not going to explain this whole code because this is a just a project video. This program he created a variables then he created methods methods are nothing but uh, if we are clicking some buttons means there should be a, some background action will be taken for example if you are clicking plus button means it will add the data so likewise we are uh, define some functions in order to do some tasks so for that only we are using this methods methods are nothing but a functions and also labels labels are nothing but a font size like that so these are the basic uh, data we are using in this project. So now I am going to run this program. And you can see this is a contact management system. Here you can do two things. The first one is uh, to add a new contact or you can delete a contact. So first I will show how to add a contact. So click this button. And my name is Subhash. and last name is yes and my gender is male and age 21 and address chennai and the contact is so once you fill your basic details i am going to click save so after saving this it will be stored directly in this GUI and also the data will be automatically stored in a database. So if I am going to delete some entries means first you have to select some data. So here I selected this data then I am going to delete. So after deleting this, this is how the contact management system looks like and if you are again running this program means you will get the same data. So because uh, it, everything will be modified and stored in a database. So this is how this project works. If you have any doubts or uh, any queries means please let me know in comment section. I will clear that. And thanks for watching. Keep supporting us. Thank you.